we go then, this is the start of the King of the Store. Longest bass competition. There go all the boys. And girls. Might be a Queen of the Store. There's Jono on Mystic Spray. And rules of today are anywhere from Shotty Lockgate to Harwich Harbour and fishing anywhere down the river. So there they go. Be an interesting one this because everyone's at the same situation. Two rods, four hooks maximum, and everyone's in the same little area for fishing. So you already start to see some of the guys, they're making their way to a known spot over there. That's the local lads from Shotley. They're heading straight over to Shotley Pier. And us alongside Cheapskate are playing our cards quite close to our chest, same as uh, Jono. Jono's got a line out straight away there, he's straight on the spinner. Take it nice and slow. And it'll be interesting to see where everyone goes. I'm on board with Marty, captain at the moment. Let's see how this pans out. This is our first go at a drift. We are next to the old shotty bay. And we'll be drifting at what? 0.9 of a knot next to it. Just looking to see if there's anything in the obstruction. Those pier legs. A real obsession just up there in the distance as well. I think everyone else has gone further down. Getting as close to this as we can. Hoping there's going to be some delicious predator on those worms. Just just through a lovely patch of fish on the screen. And as if by wonder, Marty's missed the bite. First little to look at him in uh, 34 foot of water, so quite unusual to be that deep, but we're now heading over to the shallows. Trying to find a bit of couple of features on the ground. Look at the stuff on there. Anything like this would be good. Well, fish, I think, is slow for everyone. We're up next to Ryan and Kevin and Chloe on board. Glorious if you want to go for a swim, but not so good if you want fishing because the weed is, is killing us, to be honest. Got a couple of little schoolies so far, but nothing to put on the measuring stick yet. You can see the weed on that end of that rod there, just hitting that. Bouncing off the bottom and getting caught in weed. So I think we might go and try and anchor up. One of my favourite little spots was just by that Holbrook post down the end there. So see how we go there, but what a cracking day to be out. Can't grumble, can we, bruh? Better than being sat at home. Better than doing the lawn. Not that there isn't any lawn in the moment. Easy as that. When I've started casting these really long tracers, I leave the worm on the back, free from anything. <coughs> then got the, the weight there with a bit of space. And it should just give you enough room just to give it a little flick out. And it takes the whole thing. Knock on Marty's. Little tap, tap, tap on the end of the rod. Isn't gonna come to anything? I reckon that's just a robbed you of your worms, sir. Well, at last, we've got one worth measuring. There's a 41, just under keeper size. Gave a lovely bite, but a nice bit of a morale booster for the boys. Off she goes. Much needed that one. 
Nice, right, just had a crack and bite. Yes, boy, is that in? Yep. Yes. Here we go. Feels like a good one. We're in a competition, so the net's going to come out for all fish. Little scrapper. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's, it's a little fighting schoolie. Here goes Neil and Janet on Mylor. Running off into the sunset together. And a quick change of spot. And we've got a few of the boys over there. We've got Cheapskate, we've got Salty Seagull, we've got Mystic Spray, and a sailing boat. Just caught this little fella. One big claw, one little claw. So I reckon he's been a scrapping. Nice little chap though, isn't he? Not if you're fishing, he's not a nice little chap. He's very annoying. Just a little change of spot. And this one has absolutely hammered the bait. He's destroyed that big old worm, taken the hook down, but look at the size of him. What's that, a 20 centimetre fish? But this is the beauty of the little unhooker. Because I should just be able to. No pressure. <laughs> flick him off with no damage. Obviously, that's not a measurable fish for this competition because I think the winner at the moment is about 48 centimetres. And that's coming in about 20, but cracking little bite though. Here comes my door again. Now the change of spot. Good. That's a tap, a tap, tap, tap. Come on. This is just a crab. Having the crabbing thing. Finally, we appear to be on the fish. They're only small, but with the small ones, there was hope for a bigger one somewhere. Well, Mark, he's caught himself a Suffolk Devil's toenail. So he's caught himself a dinosaur. And as we say that, the twin engine Supremos on the salty seagull, having it. Oh, they've only got one engine running at the moment. Good old boys. All right, his rod's taken off. I think we are, well, we're definitely on the fish. We found a decent little spot. I think that's the lady bee in the background going past. Day Angler 19, Orkney, diesel inboard, lovely machine. And what you got there, Marty? Fish on, another little schoolie coming through. Water so clear, just lip hooked. Cracking little fish, well, mate. It's not a blank, yep. Not unless it's just a little scrap. Bit of fish for Marty, hopefully. Get the net, get the net. <laughs> there is panic stations. He's swimming away, and Ed gets the net. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Got it, you just do the fish. Good fish, that boy. Hello! <laughs> <laughs> yes! Hey, my phone's going. Go on, get it, get it. Do it again. Oh, you're getting very big. Oh, tell you what, boy, that's not far off. Yeah, Marty's in again. Are you? He's got another schoolie. They're on the feed, Ed. We've found the fish. Ed's found the fish. 
Well done, that captain. <laughs> Quality. Right, get rid of that little fella. He's only a tiddler. Well, we'll it's uh, three minutes to six. We've been fishing pretty hard. We've been giving it a good go. And that has paid off. Look at that. 52 centimetres, nose to tail. Absolute cracking fish there for Marty. And that one is perfect eating size. That one's gonna be coming home with us as well. And so far, from what people have put onto the group. Winning fish. Winning fish. <laughs> Quality, awesome. well done mate. Almost a fish cast now on this little spot. Gavin Mills, you're heading over just to come say hello. Have a bit of social fish for the last half an hour. Lovely. That's what it's all about. A couple of boats next to each other. We've got Cheapskate there. They're playing some fish. They're getting excited. That could be a good fish on there that Mills has got. It's always good when you put your mates on the fish, isn't it? Invite them over to the hole. One. Oh, oh, could be a contender. No. Well done. Marty's had another little knock on his. There he goes, there we go. Well, that for us is the end of the day. <laughs> Heading back to Harwich, uh, Oakley Pier. Haven't shot out the winners yet, haven't sorted them out yet, but I think we're in with a good chance of Marty's fish. And uh, we'll see what happens when we get back there, but happy days. King of the Store 2022, first one we've done, longest bass competition. There's a red carpet. The red carpet's rolled out over at Levington. Fraser, one. happy days, well done mate. Cheers. Well done mate. 48, congratulations, good fishing. Liam, first competition. I think dad, my dad got the bass. Oh, hey. I came in under your nose. Yeah, sir. I know, that was the first year. That... There we go mate. Well done. Well done, well well done. congratulations. Pat, well done. Marty, here's an envelope Thank for you. you. And more importantly, quite heavy. <laughs> the title of Oh look at that. King of the store. Oh hell. 52 centimetre. 52 centimetre bass look wins at that. it. Lovely. Right on by. Cheers, Ed. Well done, buddy. Good hey. up, man. Well done, bye. That's it. Good guy. Good fishing. Time, That's Happy good, days. that frozen one worked. <laughs>